I, aku nak aku nak tanya kau lah. You, you you identify as a Gen Z or as a millennial? I don't know because <laughs> so <laughs> macam uh, I I'm not I don't really feel belong in Gen Z. Sebab macam the songs that they that they hear and macam <laughs> benda yang dia orang benda yang dia orang tak tahu macam eh kita tak belong lah. Tapi dulu masa I uh, pernah cakap dengan my friends I my group of friends tu macam okay, yang budak 2000 ke atas bukan kita punya geng macam tu. <laughs> Sebab I don't know lah. Memang dia orang punya generation macam tak ngamang kita cerita macam pemikiran dia orang pun lain macam tu. Tak tahu lah. <laughs> Mungkin dia sebab kita gambar kecil-kecil dulu pun kabur kan. Dia orang gambar kecil-kecil dah HD eh kan, gambar. Dia so, <laughs> macam... gambar video. Banyak video ah, kan. Video. Kita tak ada video pun. Ada pun gambar kabur. <laughs> so macam tak lah. Tak rasa belong lah. Rasa belong untuk millennial sikit. So, macam tu lah. Kita layan Linkin Park. Dia orang tak layan dah Linkin Park pun. Benda dia tak tahu kan. So macam, tak tahu lah. Sebenarnya ni walaupun tergolong rasa macam tak belong lah macam tu. Tak apa, it's okay. I, I just think it's interesting question to to mm. to ask on the spot. Sebab, sebab ada je, like I I think I heard of a TED talk yang dia kata actually generation, a uh, classification of generation ni sebenarnya is a myth. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, kan. Um, it could be. But I, I just think it's, it's interesting sebab the way like kita naturally classify generation is a way how we see changes in society actually like which for me mm. if you ask me that question kan dulu i ingat i millennial tau dulu i identify with millennial cuma masa tu millennial kebanyakannya dah kerja dah grad so i just thought i am a millennial yang masih belum grad kat uni mm. kan um, sebab kenapa i identify as a millennial sebab i jenis um, i i personally actually like adulting and adulthood i suka i like i actually look a lot older than i am um no betul i mean i mean bukanlah maksudnya berkedut-kedut ke apa kan but tahu tak betapa tuanya i nampak pada mata orang lain i masuk kelas for the first time i just didn't ingat i lecturer and i was like How maybe the <laughs> But, Maybe but, this. Uh, but, um, but I low-key kind of like it, you know. Oh, aku tak nampak muda. <laughs> aku nampak macet. I low-key kind of like it. But then, bila I dapat tahu pasal US punya Gen Z's and how powerful they are and I was like, wow, Gen Z ni powerfulnya. Like, I wish I could be a Gen Z and stuff like that. But And then I Google, I was like, oh, Gen Z start daripada 1996. Well, I guess I am a Gen Z then. <laughs> so that's the the start between the Zillennial. You, you ada pernah dengar tak? Zillennial, Gen Z. Gen Z. Uh, so like it's a term oh, point. Gen Z. Gen Z plus Millennials. We are the Zillennials. Yang terlalu mba ambil. Oh. Tak, tak, tak tahu. Okay. <laughs> Tegolong dah kita kerima. <laughs> bila, bila sebenarnya masa my, my first year macam tu kan? So I was very naive kan. Of course lah keluar dari sekolah agama. And we think that everyone is good. Everyone has good intentions. Everyone is not stealing any money. <laughs> so we are tak lah Nisa memang very naive masa Nisa masuk Uni Ten. And I get my first apa macam black history lah masa tu. People are taking the advantage of me because I'm being so kind and so stupid lah at that, at that time. So macam so naive lah naive lah.